I look like Sonic from Sonic Boom when he got exiled. Anyways. The title is clickbait because that will only be like five seconds of this video while I talk about myself for the rest of it because that's why I do YouTube so I can talk about myself to anyone who will listen, which is not many people. We are trying to find the Grimace Shake. We are on, we are currently on our way to a modeling convention and uh, so I can, someone will be like, I want that one. This is my second year going. We went last year too and uh, hopefully they'll, this, this year they'll be like, we want that one. There's also music people there, which is really cool. So we didn't get the one where we live because I didn't have storage on my phone. I might have it now, it's working, so we'll see how long that lasts. Um, and so we were like, oh, let's wait till we go to a pit stop. Please, please work. Okay. Let's wait till we go to the stop, pit stop. And in the parking lot, I was like, well, they're like, sorry, Grimace machine broke. Their, their shake machine is not bro broken. So next pit stop, we're going to try and find Grimace a Grimace shake to try it because it's Grimace's birthday and I want a Grimace shake because I want to try it for the Malachi food reviews. I feel like I had more jokes playing in my head but I forgot all of them. So I'll come back when we find a Grimace shake or if I have something interesting to talk about. Lake Besides Grimace, Georgia was not it. Like uh like Grimace. Got it. G given that our location you are doxing us. I'm gonna just bleep it out. I mean, we don't live here. This was a pit stop, so maybe it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Mother, don't you know anything about internet safety? You can't even tell people your favorite color. They'll, they'll find where you live just based off your you favorite color. Know, you don't want to decide my favorite color blue? Or yellow? <laughs> or pink? Now, now they're gonna find where we live! What? <laughs> Haven't you taken an internet safety class? If you tell me your favorite color, they can find where you live. <laughs> Don't even tell them your fir the first letter of your name. They'll know all your social security information. New Hell of a Boss episode came out, gonna cosplay Kesha. Or B. I'm gonna call her Kesha. Her name's Kesha. <laughs> to me. That's it. Maybe the video isn't clickbait. Maybe he's trying to find a Grimace shake and there isn't any more to the video. My idea was it's gonna be like five seconds, but we can't even find Grimace. And I was like, let me just go ahead and start the video and tell him. Oh my god. Oh my god. Wait, no. I'm also just gonna be doing stuff about convention, like through convention, what's going on. See you when we find the grimace shake, or next time we go to McDonald's and fail again. Hurry up! We got the grimace shakes. We both got small ones, and we had to pull up for our fries. I thought we had to pull up to a parking lot for the for the shake. Shake, and it was like, now you gotta pull up for fries. I'm like, put your hands up in the air like you just don't care. This is a stick up. Okay, I don't know what flavor this is. Um. Happy birthday, Grimace. Mom's taking her selfie. Mm. It is a little grapey. Yeah. Tastes a little weird. I'll drink it, but I'm confused. Yeah, my taste buds are confused between Hubba bubble, great bubble gum, <laughs> and vanilla shake. I forgot to say welcome back to Malachi's food review. It's food. I was actually drink. Malachi's drink review. Cheers. Give me my fries. Why do we have to pull up for fries? How can y'all not already have fries? It, it's a shake. I don't know how to describe it. Me and my friend have a um have a meme with him. So there's a, so we were doing hairspray at our school because we were both theater. And the guy who was playing Link, he was wearing purple shoes and purple shorts. And I had seen a picture of Grimace before. I didn't know his name was Grimace. And I was like, he. And I was trying to tell her. 
I was like, he looks like the, um, the, the grape. And she's like, the huh? And I'm like, the grape. She's like, I don't know what you're saying. And I looked up a picture. I was like, McDonald's. She, I was like, the McDonald's grape. She's like, what, McDonald's grape. So I looked it up and I said, oh, he's a taste bud. And I showed her and she, she was like, wow, Kai. Yeah, that's clearly a taste bud. You're so stupid. And now we have just a meme about the grape. And I was like, it's the grape's birthday. Yeah, now we have a meme about the grape. And I was really excited when I saw that it was his birthday. Because I was like, oh my god, I have a meme of that with my friend. Oh no. Anyways. Are we going to dip our fries in our grimace shakes? Mm. Are we going to be those people? If it was plain vanilla. <laughs> I mean, I'll get my ghost shake. Happy Pride Month, Grimace. If this, if this McDonald's didn't have the Grimace shake, this is the second McDonald's. If it didn't have it, I was gonna say during Pride Month. <laughs> Don't you know who I am? But luckily they had it, and I will not be canceling this McDonald's on Twitter. <laughs> I'll cancel the other one. One of the workers at that first one said that I looked like um, I was from the 70s. Yeah. Give an Axl Rose vibes. I'll pretend I know who that is. I'll, I'll look up a picture and put it on the screen. Am I, yeah, I, I totally do. Oh. GNR, baby. Welcome to the jungle. Oh, God. <clears throat> We're doing, so at the convention thing, there's like competitions. But, like, there's, like, multiple third place and multiple first place. It's based off your score, not how you did against other people. So, like, I think I got third place for... Yeah, I got third place for three different things last year. And we got first place for group. Group is, like, all, everyone from your agency. This one boy, our only boy, was spending time with his boyfriend instead of coming to practice. And he went to the last two practices. And we're... Th I mentioned this because she said Welcome to the Jungle, which is the song we're doing. Oh, my God. Help. Also, I think my agency got a vendetta against me because last year, my outfit, we did like Let's Have a Kiki song, and I wore a dress with Twiggy's face on it, and so I was wearing a dress that had Twiggy on it while everyone wore these like sparkly fun outfits, and I was like, wow, and now everyone's wearing these like super sexy like, I stopped the video because we got fries and I was embarrassed of people. Yeah, so like five minutes later, five hours later. Anyways, and now I'm wearing like just like a plain black jumpsuit thing with like these like leopard print boots. It's like we're supposed to be doing like a rock star safari thing. Everyone else looks super sexy and cool and I literally look so bad and I didn't say anything. So, listen, I'm a theater kid. I'll wear whatever you put me in. But I feel like she got some vendetta against me. <laughs> Not actually, but you know. Let you look sexy. Lots of 15 year old get the leotard and fishnets. And the 17 year old gets the uh, nothing. Like, come on now. I don't know where to put this bag. I don't know, but I can't hold it right yet because I'm trying to um, figure out where and how to get across. Yes. We're in a new place. We don't know where we are. We're Taurus. I'm a Taurus. We never tell each other our star signs. I don't know what that is. Oh, well, I'm a Virgo. Virgo. Oh no, I lost mine a while ago. <laughs> Have you seen that? I'm a Virgo. Oh, I lost mine a while ago. <laughs> I'm not a shake, I'm not a fries in the shake kind of guy. And I'm still not. You have to try it with plain vanilla. Oh, okay. There's some napkins. I rate the Grimace shake. Um, a five, maybe four point five out of ten. Scale? I don't have a consistent way I do things. Have I rated things before? I think I have. Anyway, I give it like a 4.5. I 
this for what why not why why not <laughs> why though are you for real whatever it's fine I was, I was gonna send a video to them i wasn't like gonna sit there and be like this is for my partner no i was i was gonna send a video to them and be like i can't sing this for you and about you but here we are i'm single again it was too late to change the song My family made this assumption and misunderstanding, so I'm going to make sure you guys don't. When I say I wrote the commercial, I do not mean that commercial went on TV or anything. I'm just saying I wrote it down and I performed it live. 
for the judges and the other competition. I did not actually write one and Hot Topic was like, yeah, we're going to put something. Like, that did not happen. My family made that mis uh, misunderstanding, so I want to make sure that's not misunderstood so no one's like, what commercial was it? And it was funny. And I was making fun of the smelly emo kids, me. But this year, I'm not, I didn't write my own commercial. I, uh, I'm doing one. It's called... Yeah, I'm, this is going to be posted after convention. They said not to post anything about, like, outfits and stuff until afterwards. This is going to be posted after convention. They, uh, I'm doing Chickaderm, which is supposed to be, like, a nicotine patch, but for Chick-fil-A when it's on Sunday, you can't buy Chick-fil-A. Last year, my monologue, I did a monologue from Heather's. It was the original movie where she was, like, um, you, I, I changed the cuss word, so I said, you idiot, you were nothing before you met me, you were a blooper, blah, blah, blah. I did that monologue. Few people later, a girl did that exact same monologue. And we met up later and we were like, oh my god. Like, we were mad at each other, obviously. Because, like, we didn't know the other was going to do that. Like, we were, we were chill. We were like, oh my god. Because we both liked Heathers and we both did the same Heather thing. You know, we were, so, I was so excited. I was like, oh my god. Um, someone I was with, she didn't know that that monologue was from Heather. She thought I wrote it. And so she thought the girl copied me. I'm like, no, it's from Heather. She was probably in that line like, I was so glad I went first. And she was in that line like, oh my god. <laughs> so I got, what was the other things I got a medal for? I got them for individual runway. Individual, which means it's an outfit that you choose. Um, the commercial. Swimsuit? No. Was it monologue? Yeah, monologue. Monologue, so commercial monologue and individual. This year my monologue's gonna be from Sherlock. Man, I should've done Heather's this year because I have the blonde hair. I have brown hair last year. You I could've done another monologue from it. Last year I had brown hair and I was doing Heather's when you had the blonde hair and this time I'm doing Sherlock who has brown hair. It's when he like first meets Sean, he's like, I know you're an army doctor. Blah, 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 blah. And then um, I was trying to write my own commercial this year again, but it wasn't happening. I was gonna do Monopoly and make fun of the uh, British family for not being able to play, uh, the, the royal family for not being able to play, the British family. Man, Monopoly, everyone talks about how Monopoly ruins friendships. Guno ruins friendships. Me, Patricia, and C are the friends I talked about earlier. We had a sleepover. We were playing Uno, and Sierra started putting away the game. I said, oh, we're done. She said, I want us to leave this room as friends. Trish went with me to convention. 